All right, so back in the day, it was pretty easy to tell the difference between a TV and a monitor. But today, uh, not so much. Might leave us wondering, uh, aren't they the same thing by now? Welcome to Simple Cafe Vision, illustrated tutorials, short and sweet. By the end of the video, you're gonna be able to know how they are alike so you can take advantage of them with all your devices. Okay, so obviously looking at the back of each is important, but what we really wanna get down to is what can we actually plug into all these? Starting off obviously a PC to a monitor, that goes for laptops as well, and something like a media player to your television set. But actually, what we want to know is, are these pretty much interchangeable? And actually, it all depends. Simple enough on whether or not your device and TV or monitor match up with the connections. As a matter of fact, that's the reason why I'm bringing you this video, is because both TVs and monitors now always come with an HDMI port. And this is where I think some people can be pretty unsure of whether HDMI on a monitor is only for computers. Or can we plug in just about anything else with an HDMI port, like this media player? And the answer is fortunately, absolutely yes. Because HDMI is made to send audio and video data. That source of data is the same from a satellite device, a video game console, a Blu-ray player, or a portable media player like this one here that doesn't have a cable. It has the HDMI very nicely integrated, as well as a Google Chromecast and an Amazon Fire Stick. That's right, your display has no excuse to not display the video data coming from that HDMI cable. As long as the data is ones and zeros in audio and video, it's gonna be able to display it just like it does from your computer. Which I think is what most of us do, of course, but hey, you can go beyond that. Use any other HDMI device with your monitor. Now let's turn our attention over to televisions. So could we take our computer and plug it into our TV set? Well, by all means, if they both have HDMI, go ahead and connect them. You can have it replicate your screen or extend out as a second display. Check out this video if you want to see me do it. Now this is for all the creative people out there. If you were thinking of plugging in your media device to your monitor, stop. 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 Sorry, but here's the thing. Yes, your media player connects with HDMI and so does your laptop. But, but. the thing is that your laptop HDMI port is made to send audio video signals out to another source, not to let them in from other devices. Oh, but how interesting would that be, having a smart TV on your laptop? So if they're so alike, what makes them different then? Well, if you wanna know, I'll show you on this next video right up here. And go ahead and subscribe to stay in the loop. Now, if you wanna help me make more videos for you, you can go to buymeacoffee.com simplecafe. Thanks, very cool. See you on the next video.